Hi everyone, it's Evangeline here at eTrailer and today we are looking at the Coglens clothespins here at eTrailer. These are going to be used with your clotheslines in order to secure your clothes while they are drying. But they can be also used in other ways like if you need to close a bag and you just need a clip or a pin to keep it closed, you can use these too. So these are plastic coated wire pins. So like the traditional clothes pins, you have that spring on the inside giving it that strength as well as that traction on your clothes. But I do like how it is plastic coated all over because the traditional pins get that rust and then that rust transfers to your clothes. For these, that's not the case. They're relatively easy to open up. Not much strength is needed to open up that lever and they do snap shut quite easily as well. So it's nice to know that they will stay on your clothes. You have two options for using these clothes pins. One is that you can feed your clothesline through the pin since it does have the opening on the inside. That way it's always on your clothesline for when you need it. The other option is just to use it as is where you, then you can clip it onto your clothes. But the downside to that is you're going to have to make sure you don't lose them. Now there are pros and cons to having it on your clothesline as well since it's permanently mounted to there you do have the issue of you can only clip your clothes on by its side instead of when you have it in the middle which I prefer because I think it's less likely to blow away in the wind when it's mounted like that. So this comes in a pack of eight so you get three blue clothes pins, three red clothes pins, and two white clothes pins. And I'm using this with our Stromberg Carlson clothesline for your RV bumpers, but you can really use this in any situation that requires a pin, whether it be your laundry bag or your snack bag that you need to keep clothes or any other clothesline. And as you're shopping around here at eTrailer, I also recommend picking up the Coglins laundry bag. It's a very simple, basic, easy to use laundry bag. Since if you are doing laundry and you do need these clothes pin, you might also want a storage bag for that dirty laundry. Now I actually use these pins as I did a little demonstration on how to wash your clothes with this clothesline. So let's take a look at that. So I have right here our Coglins laundry bag. That's what I'm using to store our laundry. So we'll just get our clothes and our towels right out of here. Now I like to use bar soap, but you can really use any laundry detergent. Just add that to your water and make sure it's soapy before you add your clothes. Then submerge your clothes or whatever you're washing into that soapy water and I do recommend scrubbing them just to get all that dirt out. So once you have all your clothes scrubbed and you got all the dirt out of them, we're then going to switch our water with clean water so that we can rinse them. You're then going to submerge your soapy clothes into the nice rinse water and just rinse that around, scrub that around until the water is clear. You may have to refresh your water every now and then just to make sure it's still a rinse water. But once that's all done, let's start wringing it out. Now, depending on your clothes, if you have something that wrinkles easily, I do not recommend wringing it. But if you need it to dry very quickly, then just wring that out until as much of the water is out there and then let's hang it up. With this dried out as much as we can get it by hand, let's now put it on our clothesline. So we're using Coglin's clothes pins right over here. Those are already attached to our clothesline. So let's just hang this up. Don't forget to pin it into place with these clothes pins. That way they don't fly off when a gust of wind goes by. We're just gonna leave these hanging up here for a little bit. It's really, really hot and dry outside, so I don't expect the dry time to take too long. And let's take a look at this when it's dry again. All right, and we are back. This has been out here for an hour, and now our shirts are mostly dry. The things that are in the back are still kind of damp, but I'm pretty sure it's gonna be really dry after another hour. So very quick, very easy, and it's nice to see how it even smells fresh and sunny. So my personal thoughts about these clothespins is I think they are worth adding on to your current list of things for when you do go out RVing. If you are planning on doing laundry, it is nice to have some quality clothespins, especially since the traditional clothespins that I use tend to get rusted or lose their spring. It's nice to see that these are strong, sturdy, and plastic coated so that your clothes stay dry and clean. And that was a look here at our Coglins clothespins here at eTrailer. My name is Evangeline and I hope you enjoyed the journey. <laughs>